Hi everyone, it's Anne from Anne Ellis Angels and I'm here with your card readings for the coming week. These are general readings, so take from them everything that resonates with you, leave behind anything else, but most importantly, enjoy a really positive week. I'll be using my teacup tarot deck and later on, I will clarify with my Time to Shine deck. Leo, here are your cards from the Teacup Tarot deck for the week starting the 10th of July. And your overall energy is lovely. It's card six, the lovers. And this is all about careful choices and decision making. And if we look at the illustration on the card, look, She's taking a time. She's looking at all these different roses that she might want to buy. But she's checking them all out first before she decides. And that's just what you need to be mindful of this week. Looking at all your options, looking at them carefully and then choosing what feels right for you. Your help or your hurdle, this can help you with your decision making. The four of coins says, just consider situations of too much or too little. And on the card, look, she's trying to balance the scales in her hands. She's got too many on one side. So this is work-life balance needs to be considered. Financial balance needs to be considered. How much time you're giving away and not taking enough time out for yourself. It all needs to be thought through this week. Your guidance here, the Ten of Coins, is absolutely lovely. This is about financial security. So clearly you're going to get your mindfulness right with this too much and too little because the Ten of Coins, it's happy times with family, financial security, peace of mind. It's one of the nicest cards in the whole deck. How can we help ourselves? Now, the seven of wands shows up and says you might need to be a little bit assertive this week and stand up for yourself. And that's absolutely fine as long as you do it with kindness. And on the card, look, she's nearly at the success flag. But between her and success is a gate with a flock of grumpy sheep behind it. And she has to walk past those to get to where she's going. So she's going to have to open that gate, be kind, gentle, but assertive, and get herself through there. So that's just mindfulness for you this week, standing up for yourself. Pulling it all together, the Ten of Teacups under the Ten of Coins. Absolutely lovely. Emotional fulfilment. It's the happy ever after card. Trustworthy relationships, quality time with family and loved ones and quite home focused as well. And your final outcome card, the eight of teacups is about taking things a step at a time. Now on the card, look, she's poised at the edge. She can see success and that's where she wants to be. She's wondering how to get there. And all she has to do is take the first stepping stone and then the next is right in front of her and so on and so forth right across. So breaking things down into manageable steps will get you to success just as easily as one giant leap. So looking at the tarot cards overall for you, wise and sensible decision making, taking into account extremes of too much and too little, being gently and kindly assertive, taking things a step at a time. And then he is the financial peace of mind and the happy ever after waiting for you. So we'll just get a little bit more information from the Time to Shine deck. The Four of Wisdom says get organised, step up, show those leadership qualities, get your plans made, get everything in place. The card in the tarot is the emperor. And at a moment's notice, they are ready to go because everything's everything's organised in advance. That's just what you need to be getting on with this week. 
here's your opportunity. The one of life comes in and this is you opening that door of opportunity. So it might be a new job. It might be a pay rise. It might be a new career, a new area of study, one way or another. This is the opportunity and it's up to you to walk through the door. Here's more gifts of abundance coming in. This is absolutely lovely. You really do need to be aware of that this week and keep your eyes open. Just what I've said here, gifts of abundance coming in, job, career, pay rise, new home, anything like that. This abundance is looking for you this week. Make sure you're ready to make the most of it. The three of thought card says, expect the situation to improve. This is about talking things over with others, getting a clear understanding of each other. It's about forgiveness. It's about healing and moving on. The nine of actions says, stay determined. Focus on self-belief and self-support. Know that you've got this and stay motivated. Even if you think it's taking longer than you think. A step at a time will get you there. And the four of thought is lovely. This is about making decisions. What a lovely way to finish the reading. It's the start and the finish. Talk things over. Take your time before making your decisions. Do it from a rested mindset. Then get your plan together. Get your extremes of too much and too little taken care of. Be assertive if you need to, then make your decision and here are your opportunities waiting just for you. Are you ready? Get ready and then walk through that door of opportunity. Stay motivated. You've got this. So I hope you've enjoyed the reading. If you have, click that subscribe button. It's free and then you'll get notified when I do the next reading for you as well. So take care now and I'll see you soon.